Welcome back to The Vocalist. Can you tell I'm excited? Today, we're listening to Felix again. It has been way too long, but you guys know I love this man's voice. So we are listening to his cover of Fix You by Coldplay. When you try your best but you don't succeed When you get what you want but not what you need When you feel so tired but you can't sleep Stuck in reverse I... I was so unsure. I didn't know what to expect. I because I don't feel like I really heard falsetto from him in that first uh, that first reaction I did in the Adele song. So this is such a beautiful surprise, especially the dexterity he has going from falsetto into his chest mix. Like, let me go back. When you try your best but you don't succeed When you get what you want but not what you need Oh my gosh, hold on. When when you get what you want, when he goes when he has that dissension as he goes down, listen to how smooth that line is. Succeed When you get what you want but not what you need When you feel so tired but you can't sleep Stuck in reverse I love what he's doing with his falsetto right there because it's not like that pure sort of like pointed resonant sound that we get from his chest voice to make it a little bit warmer, maybe a little bit more hollow. He's he's just letting off the chords a bit and he's putting it further back as opposed to like keeping it nice and forward and bright. One more time. Reverse. And the tears come streaming down your face When you lose something you can't replace when you love someone, but it goes to waste Could it be worse? Lights will guide you home And ignite your bones I won't go back, but I do want to mention, it's so, because I remember he had kind of like this country twang the first time I heard him, and so hearing him do that just gorgeous ethereal falsetto, as he's descending, there are a couple moments where he sort of has that twang come back in, and it's just a very cool contrast in colors and textures. Um, he'll probably do it again in the next chorus, so I'll wait and point it out there. And hype above or down below When you too in love to let it go But if you never try, you'll never know Just what you want just has such a powerful voice. I'm blown away. Every, 
every time. There I go again. The times I've heard him, I'm just blown away by just the volume that comes out and you can really hear just how big his voice is now that we can also hear his falsetto because with uh yeah yeah lights will guide you Okay, we still got a little ways to go. Is anyone else like just suspensefully hoping that he'll like just rail on those high notes? I, I don't know what his plan is with this cover, but I just, you can hear his ability to sing those notes. And so I know he's sticking to like the, well, he's not sticking to the original. I mean, he's doing his own version, but he's definitely trying to stay true to the original, which is why he's implementing so much falsetto. But I am so curious if he's just gonna like belt out those those top notes. Ugh. but very satisfying. It's like when someone's playing a major scale and they don't play the last note or someone's doing a chord progression and they don't resolve it. It's like the suspense, like, am I musically going to be satisfied with what happens here? And it, I was. <laughs> it was like hearing him um, sing in like full voice, the chorus was gorgeous and getting to hear um, a little bit of that higher range of his full voice again, but in the bridge. Yes, that that is what I was going for. Oh man, I just, he has such a cool voice. I think that's been the theme, I don't know, recently. I'm just hearing so many beautiful, incredible, like unique voices. And so there are times when we get like caught up in technique and we get caught up in high notes and low notes and all of these other things. But I think that one thing I think is so special about singing is that no matter what you do and how you manipulate your voice, you know, you're born with a very specific tone. And yes, I mean, we've got people who do impersonations of voices, not only like speaking voices, but singing voices and all of that is possible. But when it comes to just like being true to your own voice, you really only have one voice. You can do so much with it, but having such a cool tone like that is so fun. And it's just beautiful to hear what he did with that. I think 
I got to appreciate a little bit more of his musicianship in this video compared to his first cover, so this was lovely. I know it was, what, three years ago, so I've got some catching up to do, but that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for this recommendation and for watching with me, and hopefully I will see you next time.